Hello everyone, this is Karan here. You are welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. Today in this video, I am going to make a review of Dove Face Custom Room based on Android 10 for Xiaomi Redmi Note 8. And you get the security patch of 5th of February 2020, as you can see, with Google Play System update Android 10 and Dove Fest version Android 10 official. This is the build of 9th of February, so just two days ago, the latest build this is. I thought I should make a review of this custom room and installation process is same as the previous room uh, not the previous build the previous room which the previous video which I uploaded just yesterday or you can see just today so what are the features you get in this custom room how to install this room and what are the bugs you get in this room everything in this video so make sure you watch this video till the end now let's get straight to the video so okay as you can see add launcher you get the launcher launcher by default in this custom room yes this is this has launcher launcher by default so as launcher launcher has many customization as you can see you can customize almost everything in this launcher launcher and it is almost every free and when you swipe down you get these custom tiles quick setting tiles which you can customize from here these are the tiles you can edit from here and these are the options you get columns columns landscape quick bars rows etc and also you can see the header images there which you can customize according to your own preference and now let's move on to other things the camera you get the normal snapdragon camera and uh, sorry for one thing that i cannot test the google camera because i don't have google camera set up for now so sorry for that you can test it on your own let me show you the end to the score first the end to the score which you get in this custom room is not good in my opinion you can see 1,66,991 which is the lowest ever end to the score I have ever got in any custom room I don't know how and I don't know why but yes this is the lowest ever end to the score in Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 which was not expected at any cost you get the CPU of 70,600 and GPU of only 25,000. I think the maximum goes plus 30,000 and this one is very low. I don't know why, what's the problem behind this. So now let's move on straight to settings. As in settings, you can see network and internet, you have the option of these things, which you can customize from here and you get the Wi-Fi calling option available, which is working perfectly. And now let's move on back to battery. I cannot say about the battery backup because I've just installed this room and I'm making a review. So battery backup, I have no idea. So sorry for that also. In display, you have the option of dark theme, adaptive brightness, double tap to wake. You have the option of full screen apps, which you can force apps to ignore the notch space and use the full screen. Game review preferences are also available. And you get these things, headline body font. As you can see, I'm using different fonts now and you can change the fonts many fonts are available whichever you like you can customize according to your own preference which is a good thing now let's move back and let me show you one thing again yes touch vibration and it is not working so haptic feedback is not working this is a bug in i think almost all custom rooms based on android 10 for xiaomi redmi note 8 i noticed this bug after a long time sorry for that also now let's move on to security and you can see you get google play protect and google play system by default here and also you get the fingerprint option because my device is encrypted if your device is decrypted you will not get the fingerprint option in my opinion and if your device is encrypted like me then you get the fingerprint option available which you can use on your device and in other things system you have the option of the first updater which is not working also okay so in at last let me note it as i already shown you and the first under 10 base custom room with security patch of 5th of february the latest security patch now let's move on to other things what are the main customization options you get in this custom room first of all in theming you have the option of browse and select install themes like you have the only one available theme which you can use i will not apply this for now you get the clock option grid option wallpaper these are the things you get okay and now let's go back and you have these options 
in status bar you can customize the status system icons the status bar icons which you need on your status bar you can see volty and you can customize the volty icon according to your own preference and uh, you have the option of show low priority notification icons which is good thing and in status bar logo you can see the first logo and logo style one plus as you can see I am using OnePlus logo on my status bar. You can also customize according to your own preference. And the status bar logo and other things are almost same. Notification ticker and these things. The carrier label. You can use carrier label also if you want. Now let's go back and the quick settings. You can blur the background of quick settings. You can see uh, if it it will be by default. Uh, this option will be enabled by default but you can disable it because i don't like that so i have disabled already use default colors and these are the things you get header image is available and you can customize this header image also whichever you want whichever you need and it has a lot of customization options you can go and customize almost everything which is a great thing power menu animations and miscellaneous etc these are the things you get in customization options so the main thing is how to install this room simply boot into your custom recovery okay let me show you I recommend you to use official TWRP recovery or pitch black custom recovery but you can use according to your own preference also whichever recovery you want my data is already encrypted as I already shown you so you have to insert your pattern pin password anything whenever you enter into custom recovery just go there and go to install here you have to select the room file like I have this okay so simply swipe to confirm flash first of all as you already know about wipe you have to do these things okay if sorry if I skip already you have to wipe those partitions and then you have to install this file from here and then simply you have to do is reboot system okay after that just boot into recovery again go to install and you have to flash the open g apps from here install swipe to confirm flash and this was it after that if you want to install magisk on your device then you can boot back to recovery again and install magisk if you want and if you don't want then it's your choice this is how you can install this custom home and this is it from today's video i hope you like it thanks for watching goodbye see you in the next video